chapter 6, question 17. The distribution of scores on the SAT is approximately normal with a mean of 500 and a standard deviation of 100. For the population of students who have taken the SAT, what proportion have SAT scores less than 400? We go here, we draw it in. This is our mean, 500. The score that we're going to put in is 400. And what proportion have SAT scores less than 400? So we're looking for this part. So we're going to be looking for the tail once we compute that, that Z score. So the Z score is equal to 400 subtract 500 divided by 100. So that's equal to negative 100 divided by 100, which is equal to negative 1.00. Now we're going to go to the unit normal table. We're going to look up 1.00. We're looking for the proportion in the tail, and that probability, that proportion, those terms are interchangeable here, 1 point, or 0.15 eight, seven. B, what proportion have SAT scores greater than 650? So again, our mean is here. 650 is greater. And we want to have SAT scores greater than 650. So again, we're going to be looking for the tail here, just like we were looking for the tail up here. So the Z score equals 650, subtract 500, divided by 100. So that's 150 divided by 100. So that's 1.5. We look at that value in the unit normal table. We want the proportion in the tail, and that proportion is 0 0.0668.